Still with hockey news, Dale Hunter got what many hockey fans said he had coming. That was a harsh suspension from the NHL front office. Hunter for that cheap shot, which left the Islanders' Pierre Turgeon with a separated shoulder, will get 21 games next season. That's a big suspension, one quarter of the schedule, and he will also lose $150,000 in salary. It's the stiffest suspension ever for an on-ice incident. The incident uh, involving Dale Hunter and uh, Pierre Turgeon needed to be severely punished. Uh, and we think by suspending the player immediately and continuing that suspension in effect through the entire training camp and preseason, uh, through the 21st game of the regular season, that we've sent a loud message out that we're not going to tolerate this type of conduct and that the player has been severely punished. What well, was a very harsh suspension. Uh, the league has had uh, you know, a, a, a long history of discipline and, and, and various and different types of uh, suspensions, and, and this one has been the the harshest of of all actions that have taken place in the National Hockey League, and you know, to me, I think it was a, a little unfair. I think the, the Dale Hunter and the Capitals were at the wrong place at the at the wrong time, uh, meaning that uh, it was in New York City, and the Commissioner of the League was in attendance at the game. The main thing is, I'm not on the ice, and uh, I would love to be. I would love to be out there to be a part of a uh, you know, but be a part of the players and up there and, and play against Pittsburgh, and uh, that's something that uh, you know. I can't do it, and I'm not really mad about that. That's true. I believe it is a severe penalty. The loss in pay to this player will amount to more than all of the supplemental discipline handed out to all NHL players for the 92-93 season. If this isn't a severe penalty, then, then I apologize.